different, tricky, not, a, not an easy track to say the least. It's going to be very tight in quality, in the race it's going to be carnage. So yeah, the next two days are, are important. Today was a, a massive day of learning for you, not just the circuit, but also the team and the car. How have you found it from the team perspective working within this new garage? I found it good to be honest, you know, I'm working with the best in the business and I'm learning so much every single lap I'm in, in the car. Um, I do think the lap times are a little bit deceiving at the moment and aren't a true representation of, of the pace. I thought FP2 was, was not a great session for me, I struggled, especially in the high fuel um, and ultimately that's going to be key on Sunday, so still got a lot of work to do to get comfortable in the car, get comfortable with the setup, make some improvements, um, because I think tomorrow's gonna be a different story. How comfortable are you in the car? Obviously your height is one thing, your your feet, we heard during uh, free practice one, your, your your shoulders were still hurting given the, the comfort in there. Is there much that can be done? <laughs> um, there is, I'm pretty battered and bruised already to be honest. So, you know, we've already gone through what needs to change. It's not a work of a moment, you know, sort of, changing the seat here and there so um, yeah working hard with the guys to try and improve that for Sunday but I'm sure it'll be fun. And it's not just getting on top of the car there's processes there's procedures there's starts yeah. uh, to go through we, we know you went through a number of them today do you feel you're on top of everything that you need to be for the weekend? Uh, absolutely not to be honest I mean there's so much um, to, to take in to learn and lap after lap I'm just learning more and more and it's not I'm doing at my absolute best to be as prepared as possible but you know, jumping in the car with a day and a half, two days notice. It's tricky, it's tricky. So I'm doing my best. Um, it was, it, yeah, it was a good first day, but there's definitely work to, to be done. Let's give to, I've got to do just a couple quickly. Um, race starts, happy? Yep. Yeah, race starts, they're, they're okay, improving. They're not, they're not uh, Lewis Hamilton level to say the least, uh, but they're, they're getting better. So. Again, loads of practice tonight, sat in the car, just, just trying, trying, modifying clutch paddles to try and suit my fingers a bit more. Like I say, there's so much I do need to get on top of and we've got such a short period of time to do that. So um, I think we're in for a long night. Two P1s, have you set the bar impossibly high for Saturday? Um, like I say, in, in some ways, um, yeah. I don't know, to be honest. Just because I was quickest today, it doesn't mean that that's where I'm going to be tomorrow. And like I say, Verstappen was incredibly quick in the in the long runs. Valtteri was quickest in P2, but he got his lap deleted. He probably only gained half a tenth, in all honesty. So I'm probably a good tenth and a half behind Valtteri in the low fuel. Um, but we'll see. We're getting better.